Hey, all you jazz fans out there in the night, this is Jimmy Rudolph coming at you live. Not undead, but live from WZMB Jazz at 3. From the historic Tribeca Studios in glorious New York City, the greatest city in the world. And we are back, baby. And many of you no doubt recall we were forced to interrupt over 80 years of non-stop broadcasting due to the zombie infestation of Ot 10. Jay Bo, were you here back then? Jimmy, I was going to middle school in Colorado. I was 13. Our producer, Jamie Bogard, folks, a fine young filly, first of the post-apocalypse professionals, or pappies as we call them. <laughs> no offense. But we are back, my friends. WZMB has been reclaimed, cleansed, and recommissioned to the service of jazz. Because we're going to show those mindless hordes and the world that there's more to life than trying not to get your brains eaten. And we're going to kick it off with Charlie Parker from an original Needle Down session at Club 54. Thank you, Bird. Sweet jazz from Charlie Parker. We're going to take a call now. Hello. Welcome to ZMB Jazz at 3. Yeah, this is Tony from Fort Lee. Fort Lee. You guys got a major zombie infestation up there, huh? Yeah, they keep you running. I bet they do. What's your question, Tony? It's about the whole sniper thing. I mean, there's snipers on the Jersey side of the Lincoln and Holland Tunnel, but we don't have a sniper on the New York side. How are we supposed to keep zombies from coming through to Jersey? Well, Tony, to be fair, zombies prefer New York on a ratio of 10 to 1. Come on. That's how we know there's an intelligence at work. So our snipers are working around the clock while Jersey snipers started taking pot shots at anyone wearing a Yankees cap. Well, that's because the Yankees suck, man. Okay, my friend, you're out of here. Folks, I hate zombies as much as the next guy, but no one disses the Yankees on this show. Not our fault zombies prefer New York. Maybe it's the theater. <laughs> that's right, J-Bo. And you heard it here, folks. Zombies like the theater. We're going to take a short break and come back with more jazz at three, so don't be changing channels now. Whatever happened to Bertha? The zombies got her while she was trimming her bush. It isn't right that we have to risk our lives just to have a nice yard. The yard is your first line of defense. Make it count with A1 Decon. Our fertilizer additive is chemically formulated to repel zombies and keep your lawn green. Your bush looks amazing. Thank you, A1 Decon. Don't let the undead stop you from living. Get A1 Decon today. Available at all True Value hardware stores. Do not ingest. We're Trocador! And now, a special treat. Not every day you get a visit from the mayor of New York City himself, Mayor Rehnquist. Good day to you, sir. Another day in paradise, Jimmy. Holy cow. You know, a zombie infestation is a terrible thing, but if any city could bounce back from such a thing, it's New York. You can't keep us down, as they say. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. So, Mr. Mayor, have we got these pesky zombies on the run at last? This is the Big Apple Renaissance, make no mistake. Thanks to our partnerships with companies like Trocador in Long Island, we've been able to take back huge swaths of the city and get back to doing what New York does best, which is work and lead. Well, how about these screamers we've been hearing so much about? Yeah, the new guys. Well, so far they seem isolated to the areas above 125th Street, so you want to keep your distance from Harlem and all points north until we get this area back under control. So when are we sending more troops in? Well, we don't want to overextend our kill squads. As soon as we get the situation under control here, we'll see what we can do about the Screamers. My money is on the good residents of Harlem. I'm sure their volunteer kill squads are first rate. Thank you, Mayor Rehnquist. Jazz fans, the mayor of New York City. And apparently we now have audio on the Screamers. Jay Bo, let's hear it. Oh, whoa, that's terrible. Just still, it says something that even mindless undead creatures can feel the impulse to create music. Shit, what was that? Lock the door, j -Bo, lock... Ah, uh, folks, it looks like this building wasn't as uh, clean as the people at Trocador let us to believe. You think the tape attracted him? My God, there it is. It's pawing at the booth window. Ah, uh, Jesus! Okay, security has him. They're working now to remove the head and... Ah, oh, God, have you ever seen a spurt like that? It's like they're vacuum sealed. 
Well, I guess that's it for tonight, jazz fans. This is Jimmy Rudolph Live, Not Undead, from WZMB Jazz at 3. How long is it going to take to clean that up? The mayor make it out? Oh, Christ, is that the mayor? 